Good evening, and thanks for joining us. I'm Madeline Schmidt. At only 18 years old, an Albuquerque man has become the focus of police and the Bernalillo County District Attorney. They're both calling out a district court judge for her decision to release the teen as he quickly racks up a violent criminal record. News 13's Jeannie Nguyen is here to explain. Jeannie. Madeline, the DA's office re requested to keep Mariano Gallegos behind bars back in July, stating he's dangerous. But a judge released him, and now he's back behind bars for shooting someone who is barely clinging to life tonight. Well, Mr. Gallegos has definitely been keeping us busy. Albuquerque police say they've been running into 18-year-old Mariano Gallegos more than they'd like to. They say he's accused of two shootings within the last three months. People who are violent tend to remain violent. And so past behavior will predict future behavior. And officers are tired of criminals like Gallegos constantly being released from jail after officers worked so hard to put them behind bars. For us, it's frustrating because we know these guys are super violent and it's frustrating these guys are back out. Police say in July, the teen randomly shot at a family in a car outside of the Lindo Mexico restaurant on Central near Louisiana. Gallegos hit the driver in the hand and barely missed the other passengers. The DA's office filed a motion to keep Gallegos behind bars until trial, saying he's a danger to society. But court records show District Court Judge Christina Jaramillo denied the motion and released him on his own recognizance. We know there's a whole system in place but we are the front line that deals with these guys over and over. So it is frustrating for the same officers to arrest the same guy for two different violent crimes. Now he's in jail again for allegedly shooting a man over a girl on Thursday near Lomas in San Pedro. The victim is clinging to life. In response to this, the DA's office released a statement today expressing frustration with Judge Jaramillo's previous decision to release him. Police say, unfortunately, this has become a trend with violent offenders, even if it's their first offense. He actually physically hurt somebody. That person probably needs to stay locked up more than maybe a drug use offense or a property crime offender. The district attorney's office has once again filed a motion to keep Gallegos locked up until trial after this most recent shooting. His next court appearance has not yet been set. Madeline, back to you. All right, thank you, Jeannie. Now, Judge Jaramillo initially released Gallegos in that July case for a lack of criminal history.